Alrighty, it's your boys the Uxus, and we're back with another Goddess of Victory Nikki video. And we are doing a showcase on the rarest character, well, rarest free to play pilgrim, rarest pilgrim, Nihilister. Um, I need to get her attraction up because I think this is a character I'm still going to invest into, despite all the, you know, claims about her being um, underwhelming and stuff like that. I'm sure she is, right? I've seen videos of her, of course, in the past when um, people first started to get her, like maybe a month ago, I want to say. Um, very cool character. One of the coolest designs in the game, if not the like absolute coolest design in the game, right? Very, very cool. Um, she is actually, in fact, the only Burst 2 Pilgrim in the game with a 20 second cooldown. So she's really, really different than a lot of other you know, characters in this game, especially when it comes to the Pilgrim Tower, right? Um, Noah's the only other Burst 2 character in the game that's a Pilgrim, of course, but she's a summonable character, and she's a 40 second cooldown character, so it's not really gonna be efficient, but with this character, it's gonna be quite efficient, so. Yeah, I am gonna try to invest into this girl as much as I possibly can. I mean, I already have her skills level five, and I gave her a cube, but let's talk about her skills, right? So all level five skills, um, activates when attacking with full charge, affects self. So every time you use a full charge with her, because she's a sniper rifle, you end up getting the pierce effect. Basically, I'm not going to be controlling Malice during this showcase, actually. But basically, every time she uses her, um, her normal attack, she'll be using, she'll have a pierce, right? And the pierce radius is actually increased by 50% for one round, right? So every full charge, um, which is not bad. Right, but then when she hits two or more enemies, um, she will deal and what's it called? 28.63% of final attack is additional damage to the enemies that were hit, right? Um, so it says all affects all enemies hit, right? So any enemies that got that got hit by it will get that 28.63%, right? Um Second skill, the same thing as Dorothy's, but a bit weaker. It's only 10 seconds rather than 20 seconds. Um, and it only affects all enemies within the attack range of a sniper, rif uh, a sniper rifle, right? Which deals 87.04% of final attack of damage. And that's that's all it is to it. And then the burst skill, which is again, the 20 second cooldown skill, affects all enemies within the attack range of a sniper rifle, of course, and deals 125.95% of a final attack of damage. And then burns, which deals 10.02% of final attack and sustained damage for every one second for 10 seconds. And then also for herself, max ammo capacity is actually increased by uh, 15 or by four rounds for 15 seconds. So um, her kit already looks a bit underwhelming um, when you actually read it. But we're going to test her out in um, shooting range. We're actually going in there with a full pilgrim team because it's actually doable now, right? Um, I just slapped this about here. I was going to put Snow White, but I want Modernia and uh, Haran to actually just go through their thing. But this is pretty cool, bro. Nihilister, Dorothy, cool. So really, these are the cool characters of the game, right? Um, these are the cooler characters of the game. So of course, when it comes to Nihilister, I'm a bit more excited than like to use her because one she's not a character that everybody has um that's a free-to-play character right this is a character that takes so long to get um depending on how you go about it right if you refresh all the time like i know wills literally refresh where they would get 180 points a day that's outrageous um right it's just to get her early i wouldn't recommend it i mean unless you are will literally but um let's see her burst skill because i haven't seen her burst skill animation since they introduced her so it's about to come right now. Let me be quiet. Oh my, she still has one of the best burst skill. Like I, I need the wallpaper. I might just save up my union raid points to get a, a, the the wallpaper. Uh, but yeah, so her numbers you can quite see are quite um, quite bad. Um, but again, if anything, you could always just have her on the team just for that full burst rotation, especially when it comes to the Pilgrim Tower. Right, so it's not like she's completely useless. She actually has the most value for most players when you do end up pulling her because again, she's the only burst two character with 20 seconds for a cooldown, right? So it's just kind of just your go-to pick over Noah, right? Um, because now you can see I'm going through a full, you know, burst cycle, right? Which is very nice, right? She does also burn. Uh, I'm not sure how the burn is 
being a fan. I think, like, where's the burn? I'm not sure how the burn is actually being affected here. So we're going to see the burst skill again. Or we're going to use it. And who's burn, right? Like, it doesn't show somebody getting burned. Um, she's doing more than Isabel, of course, which is crazy. Um, she's on par with her run. Or at least close to her run, which is quite good. Let me actually just go to her, right? Um... Right, so this is what she looks like when she's fighting. She's a very cool character. Her hair is very long. I didn't, I didn't realize that is just hair was that long. Her hair is quite long, right? A very, very. Oh, she's hitting hard though, right? You can see a hundred and when she crits with that core hit, it's hundred and sixty-six. It's looking like, right, hundred and sixty-six thousand. Now, if she had that Alice build, she go crazy, right? Literally, I think if they gave Alice's build to Nihilus Therm, but made her a verse 2, it would go crazy, right? Um, I'm surprised this team actually got that high, 92 million, all right? Um, what did she end up with? 11 million, Haran 14 million, and of course, Dorothy and Modernia just had 10,000 times more damage. Um, but it's not bad, right? Because again, that's a character who's able to put out numbers for you, um, somewhat. But again... Like I said, underwhelming. I wouldn't expect her to hit that low. She is a burst too at the end of the day, but it doesn't really change much because she's an attacker still. I'm pretty sure your stats don't change based on your burst. Correct me if I'm wrong there. Um, but it's kind of like it doesn't really change much because, like I said, she's like a bust that you need to have her on your team, right? Um. Let's change up the team around where she is going to be doing. So let me take off Isabel and we're going to put in a privity, right? Um, we're just going to slap in privity there. So we can get that attack buff when we get into a full burst to see if anything changes, right? Obviously her run, her close to her run though was quite good actually. Um, and I say that because her run has virus transfer, not to mention her insane AOE ultimate, right? And my run is built. Right? I'm not going to say my Nihilist is not built. She's basically the average build of a character, right? But it's pretty insane, right? Now, the only thing virus transfer has to really, like, kill enemies, right? For it to, like, start spreading like an actual virus. But it is a, a still a very broken effect. Not Maybe not in, like, shooting range, but virus transfer. I, or, Haran still has one of the best, like, skills, bro. I'm not going to lie. I like the, the concept of virus transfer. Right, but yeah, you could clearly see. I'm not the biggest fan of sniper rifle, uh, snipers in this game, right? She crit there 100 and oh, 200k there. So, yeah, I want to say maybe if her charge was faster than she was spamming, she'd be so much better, right? Because she's hitting quite hard per normal attack, right? I mean, we were in a full burst there, I guess. Um, were we? Let me see, because now I should go to 200k per next shot, yeah. So, if she was going faster with her normal attack, she'd be so much better. What's her numbers at? 7 million, 8 million, right? She's quite close to her run. And again, her run is doing insane AoE damage, right? So, it shouldn't be that close. But I will give it to Nihilister. Still think she's pretty cool. Um, I'm still going to invest into her. I'm still going to use her because I do think she um, was still a very, very cool character. Again. But... Of course, she's not like she's a free to play pilgrim, so I don't expect her to be the new best character in the game. Um, but I don't know if they should do that because gu guilty. I still feel guilty is better, of course. But um, yeah, you see this because they're getting quite close. What were the numbers? 12 million, 15 million. Hmm. say here and there right free to play character is that cool that's probably cool <laughs> that's cool but yeah no it's still very cool right um still worth it of course 1000 percent to go for that character when you have the chance to um because again she adds just her being the only birds to pilgrim with a 20 second cool down gives her all the value under the sun realistically so you guys definitely, definitely continue to keep using her. Let me know if you do use her, if you invest into her or not. Um, and yeah, it's your boy Zeuxis. Pretty cool character, I think. But yeah, it's your boy Zeuxis, I'm out, peace.